This morning, police body camera footage shows a protester being body slammed and arrested by an Atlanta police officer during last weekend's protest. Now, in the video, you can see a dental hygienist being pulled from her car, from a car rather, in Buckhead, slammed to the ground and handcuffed. Our Latasha Givens joining us now live in Buckhead. Latasha, uh, we're learning that the officer has now been placed on administrative leave. Yes, that's right, Jennifer. That officer is on administrative duty while this case is being investigated. The incident happened right here near the Lenox Square Mall. Amber Jackson said last week she had just finished protesting when the APD officer slammed her to the ground, and she says she now has broken bones as a result of that altercation. At a press conference, her attorney, Mowally Davis, shows the video of the incident. He says it clearly shows police brutality. Jackson says she was leaving the protest and moved a barricade to get back to her car. She describes what she says happened next. The police then comes in and slams me, yanks me out of the car and slams me down. My shoulder is broken. My clavicle is fractured. I am I have never been arrested. Anything of that matter. Jackson is the fiance of the grandson of civil rights leader Hosea Williams. That grandson was also in the car with Jackson when this happened. Members of the Williams family were at the press conference in support of her. Now in a written statement, APD says the officer attempted to get Jackson out of the car, but she resisted and the officer was forced to force her to the ground in order to get her into those handcuffs. Again, that officer has been placed on administrative duty while this case is being investigated. Jennifer. All right, Latasha, thank you so much.